Hi there everybody, it's Housie from slimandstylish.com. Thank you for joining me today on another Simple Stamping Saturday. I have to say that slowly. I keep tongue tripping over it. <laughs> today is the day of the week where I pick a project that contains a bundle that you can purchase using the celebration so that you can get the free product as well, but is tailored towards beginner stampers, newbies, or people who have watched the videos and thought they look a bit... There's a, bit, a lot of technique in that. They look a bit difficult and fussy to do. I just want something simple. This one, it's for you. I love this one. It's a celebration. This is a celebration catalogue. You can ask me for it. I'll send it out. Anything in here is free when you spend £45 apart from this one. And this one, you have to spend £90 for that. But all the rest is free when you spend £45. So I've put together this bundle for you. And the bundle today is from the annual catalogue, which is this one rather than the spring summer. Again, if you want these, let me know. So the stamp set we're using today is Big Wishes. This is £18. You also have the ink. Any of our inks are £7, the coloured inks. And we're going to be using Bermuda Bay for that. The e-block. And the e-block is 11.25, and then we're going to be using the fatter note cards, and they're six pounds for 20 of them, and that comes to 42 pound 25. So I've added the chamois in, like I have with all of the other bundles I've done so far, to take you over the 45 to get your free celebration item, and they can be stamps that you can also use. Um, this one here, Hello Cupcake. That's fine with the e-block, and I have done a Bermuda Bay version of it that's on my website, so that would fit in with the items you already have. Anyway, let me show you what we're making. So in previous weeks, we've made a thin notelet and a bigger one, all with different sets. If you want to know how to make either of these, go back and check the bundles. And again, they have bundles that are around the £45 mark for you to make these. So what we're going to be doing today is first of all you want to fold your notelet like I mentioned last time you can use your block to burnish this you don't have to have a bone folder bone folders are helpful and they get a real crisp finish on it but a block is just as good when you're first starting out okay these has got some gorgeous sayings on. You've got enjoy today, happy birthday, hope your day is truly amazing and big wish. I'm going to be using, I don't know, which one shall we use? It's a clear mount stamp set, so I did explain the difference last week. Um, but just in case you missed it, we are now doing cling stamp sets. And they look exactly the same. But they're different. Cling stamp sets, you can put the labels on the back and they will stick to the blocks. On clear mount, and it tells you up here which ones they are, you can't. So even though the labels are there, you're best not to stick them to the stamp because then they won't stick to the block and you'll have all sorts of trouble. So which one am I going to use? I think I'm going to use Enjoy Today because I haven't used it. It looks pretty. Enjoy Today. So when you get your new stamp set, what you're going to want to do is take off the paper on the back, like that, so you've got the foam. If you don't have grid paper, you can purchase grid paper from Stampin' Up, but if you don't have it, you can always use a ruler um, to start off with before you, while you're trying out to see if you like stamping, there's no point in buying everything, you can just put a ruler at the bottom, and then if you like it and you want to actually stick with it, then it's going to be quite handy to get your grid paper. Bermuda Bay, now I'm demonstrating Bermuda Bay because I like the colour, but this is actually an old style stamp set, so it opens like that. The new stamp sets, the new ink set, which you will get if you order Bermuda Bay now, you'll get the new one. This opens like a cosmetics case, so you just push it up like that and slot it in like that to get your ink pad. Okay. But I wanted to use Bermuda Bay, so, and I don't have it in the new style. I'm selfish like that, I just wanted to use that colour. <laughs> Bermuda Bay makes me smile. It's one of those colours that I love. 
I wouldn't say it's my favourite colour, but it's one that every time I use, it makes me feel happy. So you don't have to push hard on it, but you do have to cover the whole lot. So it's just little light taps till you've covered all your stamp like that. And check back to make sure every bit's covered. And then you take it, you stamp in the middle. I'm hoping that's straight. Obviously I can't see because my camera is just above, but you might be able to see if I'm doing it straight. There we go. Enjoy today. How simple and easy is that, but how effective is it? Love that. And then when you finish, because you've just bought yourself a new stamp, you've made your cards, but you've got 20 other notelets and you're gonna be wanting to use all of these with this color and everything else, you're gonna to wanna to clean your stamp. So that's why I've included the chamois. I know it just makes the bundle a little bit more expensive, but for £7.50, it keeps your stamps in good nick. It does dry up, so when you get it, it's already got this sort of um, mist in it and it's in a um, air sealed type bag. But obviously when you open it and the air gets to it, it will go quite hard. I don't know if I've got one that's like that. Um, yeah, I have. So it'll go like this and it's rock solid. You cannot, there's no bending that. It's rock solid. Um, so all you do is just put some water on it and it fixes it back up again. And then I've just put it in an old DVD case. Put a hole in it so that the air can still get to it. Otherwise, I don't want it to go mouldy. And then that's it, really. To your your stamp set. And there's no more you really need to do with this one. Um, the one I did last week, this one, I put the always thinking of you sentiment on the side. You don't need it with this because that's just so pretty on its own. You don't particularly want to junk it up. So that is my card for you with this kit today. All the details of it will be on my blog. You can purchase any of these items from my online store. And as I said, it, I can put it together as a bundle for you with this tutorial so that you can go straight ahead and start making your own notelets. Hope you've enjoyed. If you have, leave me a comment below. Thanks guys, see you soon, bye.